of us, and yet he treats you as so. Servants will always be servants. That is our way, the old way. You know, the, the, the general premise of the story was, you know, Yasuke was this guy, you know, who was uh, unknown. No one bothered him. Uh, but he has this past, and his past turns out to be that he was the black samurai who was with Nobunaga at Honoji. And there was a larger daimyo, a larger energy, but I think when Lion Lotus introduced the female character, because that was his idea, because he wanted to collaborate with me on the story, and I was like, that's even better. What ideas do you have? And he was like, I want to add powers. And I'm like, ooh, like Japanese magic. You know, we don't really get to see that kind of stuff. So it just kind of became a snowball effect where we just kind of built the story even more. And then it was about how do we place Yasuke and still keep him a character that is this on this redemption arc. But as well as the music, I haven't ever heard a soundtrack in an anime that sounds like this before, which uh, is exciting. It's exciting to be part of that because, um, you know, it it's a, it's a dream come true to be able to contribute to a show, but something that I'm so close to and something that makes so much sense, it's like, yeah, it's it's amazing.